my question for you is, has anyone ever heard of a musical style called the blues? A few of you, very good. Well, I wanted to give you a little bit of information about the blues. The blues comes from the African-American music tradition going all the way back to slavery, which was a terrible time in our country's history. But it started when enslaved people working in the fields on plantations, picking cotton and sugarcane and other crops, for example, would sing songs, chants, shouts, and hollers about the work that they were made to do just to get through their day. And later on, when slavery ended, different styles of blues were developed by black performers such as Robert Johnson, Mamie Smith, Lemon Jefferson. Are you writing this down? <laughs> Ma Rainey, Sun House, W.C. Handy, and many, many others. And the tradition is passed on down to this day. Now, blues songs can be about happy, hopeful, spiritual, loving things like one of my favorites by a singer and guitar player named Memphis Minnie called I'm So Glad. But many blues songs are about sad things like loneliness, despair, oppression, and even hurting each other. All things that many blues singers and those around them experienced in their lives. Now, I have to say, I am very lucky, and I have never had anything like that happen in my life. However, there is one thing in particular that does make me very sad, and you've probably already guessed it. That's right, the alphabet. <laughs> yeah. Didn't you know that the alphabet makes me very sad? Well, my friends in the Tufts Wind Ensemble are going to help me here so that I can share just why I have the Alpha Blues. And a one, and a two, and a one, two, three, four. <laughs> Z. 
so sad. Well, thanks everyone. It was good to get that off my chest. <laughs>